this is Shannon welcome back to my channel so for today's video I'm going to show you how I remove my acrylic nails using the soak off method so I'm going to just hop right into the video so I'm using my Texas tornado drill bit and this is one of my favorite drill bits for removing top coat and also for debulking the nail so I'm going to file it as thin as possible there are a few reasons why you want to debulk and file the nails as thin as possible first is to make the process a lot faster soaking off nails can be a pretty long process so doing this step first will speed it up for you also because in most cases top coats aren't soak off products so the acetone won't penetrate through the top coat so you have to remove that in order to get the acrylics off in general all five fingers I'm going to use these foil remover wraps that I purchased from the artisan professionals brand and some acetone so you just want to pour the acetone directly onto the cotton pad and place the cotton pad directly onto the nail and use these little clips to hold it into place after soaking for about 10 minutes, I'm going to remove the foil and use a medical cuticle pusher to scrape off the product. Now it should just flake away, that's how you know you're using some pretty high quality products. There are some brands that sell MMA products, which is a dental acrylic. It's really dangerous and it's not safe at all for acrylic applications onto natural nails. It can damage your nail completely. So if you don't know about the dangers of MMA, you want to go ahead and do some research on that. Um, you can tell if your products are MMA when you're removing them. MMA products are extremely sticky when you're removing them, which is how you can tell that you're using MMA products because they're very hard to remove from your nose once you have it on. on my nails so I'm going to repeat the same process of applying the foil with the acetone and soak my nails for another 10 minutes. After my 10 minutes is up I'm going to go back in with that same metal cuticle pusher and scrape off as much of the product as I can. I'm just going to take a hand file to speed up the process a little bit so this is a 100 100 grit hand file and I'm just going to go back in and file off as much of the product as I can before soaking again
product is removing a lot faster than the rest of the nails so I'm just going to repeat these same steps because there's still a small amount of acrylic left on those nails. one in the bunch it still has a small amount of clear acrylic on there so I'm going to soak that one again the end of the video so I'm going to insert a short clip of my natural nails without any products on them so I really hope that you all enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video bye guys